Hello, Dwayne. My name is Jasmine. We're Dwayne and Jazz. Today we have Morbius movie review. Mm. Oh, we're about to get into this one. This is going to be a good one. <laughs> Jazz, you, you, <laughs> you, she had a lot to say on our car ride home, man. Mm -hmm. All right, if you guys have reaction, guys, please follow our social media in the link in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's dive on in, man. What we're so, gonna talk about, man. Y'all know that when this movie came out, right? Well, first of all, it took forever for the movie to come out. And yeah, then when delayed, it did delayed. come out, people stopped caring about it. Mm -hmm. But we wanted to see every Marvel movie regardless, because they might be connected to, you know, bigger stuff that's happening, you yeah, know, the end credits. Yeah, or exactly. So and plus we like Morbius from the The nineties um, animated the 90s animated, animated Spider Man, yeah. yeah. So we're just like, okay, let's go see it. And like we're seeing a whole bunch of people um give it like bad reviews and stuff like Already. that. Already. Like that the Rotten Tomatoes like seventy like, yeah. percent. But we that usually and the audience scores that matter. Doesn't, that doesn't right. really warp my view of what to expect from this movie because yeah. I'm like, okay, that's just their opinion. Mm -hmm. Let me go see. Man, it was right, bro. It's just <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> they was <laughs> I'm sorry. That that was Something. Oh my it God! He said he was right, man. Y'all was expecting you to go. Uh, it was go right, like that. man. Okay. Um, <laughs> go ahead. What, so, yeah, so like in the begin, in the beginning, it's like you know, you know, it, it's the same formula, you what? know. Uh, origin. Mm -hmm. Something happens. CGI fight at the end. It's the yeah, same it's formula. It. it was like the whole movie. Same was like formula. CGI and like you could tell that this movie, how they set it up, was supposed to be rated R. But yes. because it's PG-13, we didn't get to see anything. Like, they like, legit had, like, so many fights. First of all, wait a minute, hold on. Before I even talk about that, Michael Keaton, not even in the movie. Michael Keaton, the um, the uh, vulture, basically, like, we all saw in the trailer, didn't show up in this movie at all. He well, only showed up in the, the post credits. credits. Yeah, if so if you just leave, like, a lot of people do, because they're not very long. They don't talk about that. But a lot of people do leave. Then you won't see Michael Keaton. And the what's crazy is, about it. Before, you didn't even have to wait that long. Right? No, they ain't. You know why? <laughs> they knew. They knew. They knew that we was going to get out that thing real fast. So they said, said wait. Because usually, usually with Marvel, uh, Marvel movies, you have to wait a long time. Yeah, they make, you, make you wait. To see, like, one credit or two credits, however many. This movie had two end credits, and we saw both of them within a span of three minutes, okay? It was so, back to back. They were, like, back to back, okay? But... Basically, okay. He, so let's explain it. Let's explain. Basically, my because this what this what y'all really want to know is about Spider Man. Let's be real. This is what Spider Man's villains, and they're now they're trying to make every villain which a he, damn anti hero. Yeah, which which Spider Man in the movie, his poster and stuff that we saw in the trailer. That it said, said murderer. murderer. And stuff like that. Not even there. Not even in the movie. Um, <laughs> but yeah, go ahead. So yeah, like so they're trying to make. It seems like they're trying to make every villain an anti hero. Every villain cannot be an anti hero. Because then it just takes the, the feeling and the specialness of having an anti-hero just null and void. Mm -hmm. So now, Michael Keaton, so what happened in the post credit? Because we're just going to skip over the movie. You guys get it. You know, basically, more, a vampire, he, 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 he don't, he they don't even have, have real blood. They have artificial blood. He was trying to fix a cure. He was right. trying to fix a cure. He's really smart. He's a doctor. He was trying to fix a cure for his own disease that him and his best friend have. Milo. And um, in order to get that, you know, he has to do some stuff with some bats to figure out yep. just, like how he can fuse like their, their cells DNA. together basically like that and and it worked it worked but it made him now drink blood and mm -hmm. you know become a vampire and stuff yeah and he has artificial blood and and we were just like the artificial, artificial blood, blood. Is blue yeah so that made it pg-13 okay <laughs> i think so for him to drink it yeah we were, we were like, uh, how does that work? We were like, how does artificial blood work? And then and then he was like, he needs human blood because artificial blood starting to wane on him and he started to build a tolerance. So I was like, we're just like, okay. And then his friend didn't, like, he was like, you just gonna let me die. So I'm like, oh, it's pop, you know, you know, but I'm becoming a monster, dude. Like, I'm, I'm like out here killing. Side effect, like, yeah, even though, like, I'm stronger now, the side effect is I'm a vampire, basically. So. And he, the whole time, I was just jealous of him. And then, you know what's crazy? At the end of the movie, right, mm -hmm. he makes, like, basically... Uh, a kill switch, like, like a, like a. Oh yeah, like, yeah, like, like, a, like, a, a, like almost like an anti venom. Like a, yeah, like a, like. But well, it, no, but it, no well, it's no, actually, no, no. It actually yeah. is like a. It, he's gonna kill both of him and Milo because he's like, we can't be going around. Milo going crazy, killing everybody. He he's getting more feeling for. He want to get some blood. Mm -hmm. So you know he, he he has it. They have this big CGI fight at the end, mm -hmm. and you can't see nothing. 
all of their fights, <laughs> you know, the entire movie, you can't see it. Like, oh, oh, wait, wait, you can see it, but it's slow motion. No, no, no. Every no. fight was slow motion. There was a slow motion scene in every chase scene. Y'all, <laughs> this is this how the movie, this how that fight scenes went, okay? Imagine my left hand is Morbius, right? My right hand is the person that he's fighting. Milo, right? yeah, Milo. This is it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my. Like that. It was. It was. Can't see anything. Slow mo shot. Can't see anything. Can't see anything. Slow mo shot. And it's like you could. The slow mo shots are always all of them like looking like They're they gonna slash them. But I don't ever see the slash. So mm -hmm. it's like I, I'm assuming he got hit. I don't know. Yeah. Cause I can't see it. I saw more things in the Batman. I saw more <laughs> action happen in the Batman movie. And that movie was dark as hell. I can't see nothing in this one. This one was lit. So I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I that's couldn't true. see anything. That's true, that's and true, then that's true. it was like the villain's whole motive for being a villain didn't even make sense to me. Cause it was just like, okay, it's like the villain. We need a villain. We need a villain. It, or, well, or, this had spoilers, so y'all. Y'all already know. Right? Okay, so the villain was his best friend, right? Okay, yeah. so his best friend wanted the serum. He told him no, basically, because it was like a curse, like he's gonna become a vampire and stuff. His friend. Hey, yo, I don't care. Like he didn't care. Okay? No, I didn't care at all. So he. He set up, he, the friend got the serum anyway, took it, drank somebody's blood, then made it seem like Morbius did it to get him in jail. And then he's walking around like free bird and everything. And then he's like, you know, visits him in his jail cell and then like bait, lets his canes and basically let him know like, hey, I took yeah, the serum. That serum. And then I Morbius broke out, shot to confront him like, yo, why'd you do that? It's dangerous. And he's like, oh, I finally get to live. You know, I finally get to be mm -hmm. happy and stuff like that. And because Morbius doesn't want to live like that, he's now mad at Morbius mm -hmm. because he Which, doesn't want to live like that. Right. And because he doesn't want, because Morbius isn't living the way that he wants him to live, he said, now you got to die. But he, well, Morbius also wanted to stop him from doing what he was doing, but he didn't care. He's yeah, like, he didn't care. He and said, so, I want the human blood. He could have yeah. probably took artificial blood. Listen, it's so just... this whole movie, he was just over there, the villain, the best friend, was yeah. over there fighting Morbius, trying to make him live how he wanted to live. And if he didn't, he was going to kill him. And then there was a point where Morbius got the little, like, you know, serum. the he shutdown the serum. serum. I'm going to yeah. call it the shutdown yeah. serum. Gave it to him. And then he was like, oh, no. Like, you can't, you can't, you're can't, kill, not, you can't kill me. You gave my name, like, Milo. Yeah, you know, you but you name, was, Milo, we best friends. I was going to kill you, though. I was definitely about to murder you. Don't kill me, bro. Like, we can't do this. We can't be fighting like this. Like, like I didn't understand. <laughs> the, I didn't. It's just. It didn't. I thought, and Gerald, don't let me wrong. Gerald Little did fine. He did just fine. Like, I, 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 he I, I like, I like, you know. He had to know. work with, but yeah. he was just like. And then at the end, his girlfriend, I'm not going to go into details. His girlfriend ended up becoming a, a vampire, too. So now you got her. Now he might have to deal with her if this dude gets into. And then I don't even two. know why Tyrese was in a movie. Shout out to my boy Tyrese for getting that bag, man. Shout out to my Ooh, man. It's your bag, but he had no you know? impact on this movie whatsoever. Yeah. It could have been a random Joe. That could have filled his spot in the movie, I mean, and yeah. nothing would have yeah. changed. Yeah, yeah. But shout, hey, get that so, back, Tyrese. Hey, get that back. <laughs> but, then, look, what? but look, but I'm saying that's that is true. And the police were just police. You know, they don't even hate helping. I mean, I, I, I ain't even mad at him because it, I mean, they, what is, they, they pretty much, they pretty much did their job. They found out who it was and they put him in jail. Mm -hmm. But it is what it is. It's the post credit scene that we, I want to get back to. It's because Adrian Toome, you see from, you know, No Way Home, mm -hmm. that, you know, the little purple thing that they did, you know, ended up putting Adrian Toome, a.k.a. the Vulture, in the Sony-verse now, with Ven where Venom is at, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. And now, he's in there, and now he's on the news, like, yeah, they like, yeah, they're going to release him because he's in an empty cell. It was an empty cell, yeah. and then he just popped up in it. And so yeah. now they're, like, basically going to release him from jail, so they don't know how he got in there. Right. And... Now there's a second credit scene where Morbius meets up with him, and like the middle of the night, Vulture is in his whole a whole bird. He was able to create his whole me mechanic in, a, in suit. another universe Vulture that suit. he's not familiar with. Right, he's right. Just able to get he the just, suit. He just that cool. Okay, yeah, he's just able to get the suit already. And then he dropped by. He said, yeah, I've been meaning to talk to you, and I don't know how I got in this universe. It has something to do with Spider-Man, bro. And I want to team up. Morbius says, sure. <laughs> That's so, it. So, I'm like, so, look, so, like, I'm thinking, like, in my head, I'm like, okay, so, is there Spider-Man in this universe? And I'm like, are y'all referring to Andrew Spider-Man in this who, universe? Are you referring to Tom? Or, who, who or is there about? a new Spider-Man that we're about to get introduced for the Sony-verse? 
We don't know. And then I'm we like, just does know that Morbius even know who Spider Man is? Right, because there is no hints of like Spider Man. They didn't show nothing about Spider Man in the movie. No, no. So I'm like, does he know no. or does he even care about Spider Man? Right, and, they, and, it's, and then what's crazy is that he was driving and they went in this just location, just just random location, and he just like, hey Morbius, I heard a lot about you. I don't know you, and why would I want to go? Like I don't know, I don't know, man. I, I just. I just did. I, and that's I why understand. they gave us those end credits back to back. Because they was like the movie ended because they knew we was gonna leave at that joint. They didn't. They knew. Right. They knew. But I need, it was. I just. I, I need was, Sony. Listen, Sony. I love Sony. You guys come out with some. When you guys want to, you guys come out with some great stuff. Just, just please make it R rated. Like, like stop. Like, you know how much better the movies would be if you just go there? Yes. The fans, this is, the the fans will come. I know you're trying to get the whole pot, you know what I'm saying? It, movies have been successful, but they will probably, it's not like we didn't, haven't seen other successful R-rated movies. Deadpool, Logan. Now, may, I, may I go on? May I go on? And then if it's because y'all want to appeal to the kid audience, first of all, a vampire sucking person is not child friendly. Okay, so <laughs> not to begin let's, with let's anyway. Just, yeah, let's just get that out the water. Like that's not gonna no. I feel like so, they could. I think they could be so much better if it was just R rated. I just want them to just stop playing and just go there. These these characters these are villains. Okay, not everyone needs to be an anti hero. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Not is every villain gonna be anti hero? They what? The thing that's getting me is like, if y'all just make these movies rated R, they'll be a freaking slam dunk. I and think every so. time that we think it's gonna be a slam dunk, it ends up being a air ball. <laughs> like we just be like, oh, oh, it's coming, and then no, yeah. Then it's like there's a few times where we like, slash throats, and I literally didn't see nothing out of the. No dude's blood neck. came out. I, didn't, like, I said, oh, is he sucking sound. from his finger? No, he's he's yeah, like we with heard the thing. sounds of the sucking, but we didn't see no blood. And then the blood almost looked black a lot of the times. Yeah. A lot of the times when they yeah. slash a regular human, it's not like they slash in another vampire and the blood is black. Like, oh, that might be the reason. Yeah. No, it's a regular Joe. A regular Joe is getting slashed. And his blood. And- his blood is black, and then we don't even see him gushing out. It's just him holding like, a shirt, like he just got a mild cut, and then yeah. he died from it. Like yeah. what the? F- oh, man, oh, well, uh, one through ten, Morbius, one through ten. Give it a five, cause he did what he could. He did what he could. could. I'm not even mad at Jared Leto for this one. That's it's what I'm not saying. It's he not did even what he could. He, I like I like Jared Leto, so yeah. I, you know, I give I give five as well. Um, anyway, guys, comment below. Let's know what you think. Don't get to like, subscribe, and share. It's just support. Deuces.